Welcome ladies and gentlemen to Let's Play Prison Architect. My name is Weasel and today it's time for another challenge. We're going to be selling our prison from the last time. Our sweatshop prison. We're going to get 500,000 for that. That's not a whole bunch, but I didn't want to like spend all of this time waiting until the cash goes up. We've been doing well. Look at that, 17,000. Anyway, we're going to sell that so we start a new prison with that money. I mean, all these challenges are connected. And uh, this time we're going to go with... J.W. Periwinkle. Yes, guard dogs have 50% chance of fully uncovering any tunnel they detect. Whatever. I don't care. We're going to be playing with gangs, events, weather and temperature, staff needs, and that's about it on a small map because this is going to get interesting. This is the... I mean, you know, you've, you've seen the title. This is the Armory Challenge. <laughs> It'll be great. We're going to be building a prison first things first before we do anything. And in this prison... What's very important, well, fill, fill capacity. What's very important in this prison is that the prisoners have always access to an armory. That's the most important part. We're gonna start by building a nice big ass concrete, um, concrete prison. I wanna say, yeah, just like the 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 beginning over. Here. Let's make it bigger. Let's make it nice and big. You know what? Let's let's go all out. Let's just let's just do that. Bam, and then we have everything in one prison. Wouldn't that be great? Nah, that's for another challenge. So we're going to build the uh, basic beginning, uh, which is going to be the reception and the holding cell and the shower. All of that good stuff that all goes kind of like this. This is usually what I like to do. Um, for safety reasons, not that we're going to have a whole lot of safety, we're going to be adding a fence to this whole shindig. Uh, roughly like this, and we're going to be using doors, uh, uh, road gates. Road gate. To keep uh, the prisoners in, hopefully. I mean, that is at least the plan. This thing is also going to need an entrance, and we're going to be making use of a jail door just as an additional safety measure, so to speak. It's not really going to be another safety measure. Uh, we're going to put another fence down. I think this is a good size place for that. I don't even know. Uh, and on that fence, we're going to add a door. No, we should probably also add a jail door. It's going to make deliveries... Probably, eh, let's do it later. I'm, I'm so undecided sometimes about what I want to do. Uh, as long as this is done, we're good. We're going to be using a quick build. Where is it? The utility room. Because I want to get there quickly to what I want to do. Very important. Um, yeah, sure, that, that will work. I don't think we're going to need those connected technically, but I'll just pull a wall for there and whatever. That's okay. You guys are busy. We have a little bit of extra cash money, so I'm going to throw two workmen out, and we're going to hire our warden, so he will start researching things as soon as possible, which is for the most part security, but first finance, then security. And after that, the armory. Isn't he, where do we get that from? Oh, yeah, from the security guy. That will happen. Okay, we're already out of electricity, it looks like. No, we're good. For a second, I was worried there. Uh, since I don't want to be dealing with any of this stuff later, I'll just be building the... Where is it? What is it called? Utilities. The capacitors around it, right off the bed. Yeah, it costs a bit extra, but we can afford it. Definitely. There's the door. Beautiful. Oh. Well, this, is, this looks very awkward now. I guess we're going to extend this now a bit. So we have entry, uh, access to this. And demolish that wall while we're at it. Beautiful. I know, I like I like saying words like beautiful sometimes like over and over again. It's just a habit I have. I sometimes hone in on a word and I just keep repeating it. I don't know what it is. Uh, I used to have that when I learned a new word and I would just keep repeating that over and over again. Much to the dismay of my parents, but hey, their fault for having me, right? So, okay, first things first, we're gonna work with a reception because this is a very organized prison and it's very important that we take care of that. Yeah, this is a pretty good size. Uh, let's put some concrete walls around that because screw brick. We're going to have money for brick, fancy brick work. I don't even know if brick or concrete is more expensive in real life. Absolutely no idea. All right, reception is going to need a table and a chair and an office desk. The usual suspects um, to process any incoming prisoners. You don't necessarily need that, but it helps with security. Not that that's going to be much of a thing we're going to be dealing with. And a chair. Beautiful. Next thing should be the holding cell to keep our prisoners, well, to, to, to hold them, obviously. And that looks good. 
I think I'm going to build like a big nice shower over here. We're not going to have a canteen yet though, so I don't like that. I guess I could attach that, the canteen to the left and the kitchen down here to the right and then keep extending that. You know what, I'm going to do that before I finish this off. We're going to add the kitchen like this. Beautiful. We're gonna, we can then extend, extend it. See how I say beautiful again. And a canteen to the right. Let's rotate that and... I like that actually. This works really well for me because we can then have a, a three wide hallway to extend this whole building. Like it. Like it a whole lot. Okay, large jail door goes to the holding cell and the holding cell we're gonna have a... Bu -bu -bu -bu. All the things that I need. Toilet and bench. Bench and a toilet right here in the corner. Let's do two toilets because I feel especially fancy today. And... It's, it's it's a partner toilet. We're gonna put two doors in here and you get to have either two toilets or you get to, you know, like, share it. It's very important. It's, uh, it's for social skills if you share toilets. Alright, little canteen, little kitchen. That's actually really nice. I'm not gonna say filter capacity. I'm gonna say total prisoners. So let's bring that up to 8, 16, 32. 32 prisoners sounds good to me. It's a, it's a good number. I'm gonna do medium and minimum security. Uh, I will not do maximum security because I'm actually right now curious what happens with medium security prisoners if they are going to be uh, using the opportunity of a uh, freely available gun to them. Uh, before we can do that, we need an office. Offices are very important so we can't... Oh, sorry, I gotta go into room. Offices are important so we can't put our warden to work with... Uh, you know what? We should probably keep this hallway free. And I wouldn't mind just having them in the middle. What is that? Is a 4x4 four four is the minimum? We're going to make this smaller. Sweet. 4x4. Four four. Another 4x4. Four four. Oh, yeah. I like this a lot. Okay. Two offices. Actually, let's get, get free in this. I know, Wheatley. I have the bird with me, if you can't tell. If you can't, you know, hear from all this annoying screaming. Okay, that's good. Office, and we're just gonna squeeze another one in here because offices, you can always use them. I've never built them that close to the holding cell, and I'm I'm almost positive that this is a horrible idea. So far, so good. Could have cloned those, but that would be too easy. We're gonna need a guard to let this poor workman in. They can't come in right now. <laughs> that's funny. I like that a lot. So beautiful. Um, eight are allowed, and there they are! Yay! Hey guys, welcome to the party. We don't have an armor yet because we haven't researched it yet. That's why I'm working on those offices. Okay, suck some discs. Zip, 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 up. In that goes. Chairs. Chairs for days. I like that. And of course, the filing cabinet to file away all those cabinets. Uh, to cabinet the files. Why can't you? Oh, you don't have. Oh, you don't have a door. Right. That might do it. Very sorry. Uh, I guess a door. Yeah. Fuck it. Let's put a door in there. We're just gonna have to watch that nobody goes in there. That should. That should help. That most certainly should help. Um, a staff door to deliveries would be a good idea here at the kitchen, which means I will be extending this whole shindig and put the staff door here. Garbage. Excellent. Let's remove that. Garbage over here. Deliveries are down there. I will actually be moving a deliveries a little bit closer over here because food deliveries also obviously count. Um, what about exports? Not that we're plan that I plan anything on doing that. I'm just planning here a nice little prison that's really flawed on a security level. But it'll be fine. It's it fine. I could put a cleaning closet in here, like a super tiny one, because I don't think cleaning clo a cupboard. You know, three by three. I could squeeze one over here in there. Three by three. Mm, maybe. Not sure yet. For now, we just have a big hallway for what it's worth. Uh, I'll figure out something to do with that later. Would you mind building this, guys? This is important. Oh, yeah, right. We're going to have to hire two cooks. Just the standard beginnings. You've, see, you've seen it a million times. You know exactly how it's done. And 
the only thing you can do at this point is just face palm at all the mistakes I'm making. I know, I know, I know. I appreciate you watching me, though. I, I really do. I know. I know. Okay, so if the warden, the warden's been researching security now, so I'm... Oh, wait. First, finance, because we're going to have to hire a bunch of guards, and then security. So that should be done fairly soon. In the meantime, we should be building a yard. Yards are... Well, what are yards? Excellent question. What are yards? What is love? Baby, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me no more. Cool. Little little yard for our holding cell guys here. Just because I'm such a nice guy. Should I put just a right? Yeah, I'll just... Nah, I gotta put a jail door here. You're not allowed to use a regular door. The game is weird like that. Won't allow you to do these things. Now we have a yard. We're also going to need a shower. Oh, you know what? I could probably have a weird shower room uh, over here. Why the fuck not? Let's make it like a nice narrow one. Uh, two rows. Very close to the exit, he realizes very quickly. All right. Here's the shower. Uh, as a door, we're just going to use a regular one. No reason to do anything else. And drains in the middle. Right here in the middle with you. And where are my shower heads? Shower heads. Oh, there they are. I'm sometimes blind. Things that should be very easy to find. I notice that too, by the way, a lot when I watch other people play games. Yes, I do that sometimes. Uh, that they just don't see it. I think you have a different focus on the game when you don't need to talk. That's, that's the thing that I always bring up. Okay, staff, accountant, pow, 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 pow. There you go. You can research extra grand, I guess. Okay, you're going to be working on this. The warden, after that, prison policy sounds good. Health, we're going to need that. And then the maintenance, beautiful. So this looks good. Uh, we have four guards. I'm going to bring that up to eight. Just so we are ready for whatever might come our way. And there you have a prison. I should be planning out some prison cells. I think that's a good idea. Luxury cell. Uh, basic cells. Yeah, this looks good. Luxury cell. Yeah, that's too much. I don't, I don't, I don't care about that. Some basic cells sound like a good plan. Can I just... The question, though, that I have. Can I just plop them down like this? Yes, I can. It allows me to do this. And that's basically what I'm going to do to um, increase that count right now. Because I'd like them to have their own cells. Oh, this is beautiful, 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 beautiful. We're just going to make this very long. Uh, looks about right. Oh, wait. I should not do this here because we want to extend the canteen. So let's just extend them like that. Foundation... Yeah, that's going to be a thing. Like that. Perfect. Actually, wait. There. Perfect. Ah, great. Now is the wall missing again. Are you not accepting the walls there? Probably not. All right. Time for utilities. We're going to be bringing down the pipe. They're going to be using to dig through that, aren't they? And it looks like we built two walls next to each other. That is unacceptable. Can't handle it. Uh, demolish walls. Warmth. Stop complaining. People are so... They're, they're the worst. Um, while we're building, we're going to have to be careful that they don't escape. I don't think they can right now because there's a goddamn wall in the way. So we're going to be demolishing that wall. I mean, hopefully not right off the bat. It would suck if they already escaped. Like, right off the bat. That would really suck. Cool staff. We're going to hire two more cooks because I have a feeling we're going to need a little bit more uh, muscle power to deal with all of that. And under policy... Oh, we don't have policy yet. I want to set prison policy. That'll be research soon. Oh, yeah. Security. Yeah, we have one. Now research. Always takes a while to get there. But he's now going to work on our armory. Oh, so excited. So excited. Would you mind guys finishing this up so people can't escape? That'd be really, really fucking dandy. That'd be great. Here, I give you two more men so you're a little bit faster. I'd like that. Um, cell. We're gonna extend this cell a bit. 
You get an extra special cell. The extra wurst. The extra sausage is a German thing we say. If you get, you know, a little extra, like more than the others, you get an extra wurst. That you do. It's usually not a good thing because you're preferred and people don't like that if someone gets the extra wurst. So, now that's taken care of. These guys are gonna be okay-ish. I don't think I want minimum security though. I'll actually take those out. Screw that. We're gonna go with medium. I will eventually switch to maximum security. Don't you worry. Who do you think I am? Some savage? No, no. We're gonna go with, with that. But first, I wanna see what our me- Oh, that's remote access. I'm an idiot. I should've researched armory. How did I not see that? Ah, well. Unlocks the armory room, which I will be putting, I guess, right here. Free access. Oh, yeah. Good idea. Um, with the regime, which we can Oh, we can set it. Uh, we're gonna just allow free time. It's just gonna be like a very lax kind of day, you know. Uh, you know, gotta have some time. There's yard time. There's mandatory yard time, which is very important. Uh, and then eating two hours and then I guess some more sleep. Yeah, sleep is important. Hope you'll enjoy that. Good. I don't see what's going on in this prison. Well, my warden could research something else in the meantime. How about cleaning? And then groundskeeping. What's happening? Oh, foreman. Right. Right, right, right. I need a foreman for that. No problem. That can be hired. Pow, pow. Pow, pow. God, God damn it. There you go. That was a, that was a difficult berth. All right. We have 16 cells. I like the idea of like being able to put another row here, but I kind of feel that that'll, that'll be tricky. Um, yeah, we'll see. I think I think the armory is gonna be the next big thing. Oh look, we have a rave over here. Oots, 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 oots. Man, dude, you should have not taken that E. Bad time, brah. Yeah, I can't I can't have someone taking drugs on the job. Had to fire him. I had no, I had no choice. It's a security risk. You know that. All right. Some serious have some some serious have prisoner complaints. It's tired. It is Halloween and it is tired. I mean, when you're gonna watch, this is gonna be a day after Halloween, so it's not Halloween. It's time for Christmas. Christmas music everywhere and cheap Halloween candy. Go out today, buy some cheap ass Halloween candy. Yep, you can save some uh, some nice money there. Yes. Save some candy. Um, oh shit, the toilets aren't hooked up. Why is that? Because I didn't hook up the, the, the pipe. That's entirely my fault. Well, we'll get some toilets, don't worry. Oh shit, yeah, right, yard time. The yard is over here. Making this all a little bit awkward because they have to go through the holding cell. I just realized that, you know what, I don't care. That's okay. Do I have another office left for- oh yeah, my chief. Excellent, he's still researching. Ah, oh, armory approved! Hooray! It's that time! Okay. I want to build a nice big armory. Uh, we're gonna need some room for the canteen. How about... Right about here. Oh, this is a big one. This is a hoo -hoo -hoo big one. Uh, yeah, we're gonna put a nice... Uh, nice double door on both sides. Very important that they can just enter at will whenever they want. Uh, these guys are gonna have to finish this up real quick. You mind? Okay, let's be careful that nobody escapes right now. Shit, did I not lay cable? How am I so blind to the needs of my prisoners? Oh, someone's angry. I don't like that. Everyone go in there, deal with this angry prisoner. Is he trying to escape? Are they trying to escape right now? Not really. Oh, he got knocked unconscious. Well, that sucks for him. But that's not my problem. Oh, electrical cable into the armory so people can see when they get a gun. Uh, armory. Oh shit, I gotta, gotta set that up first. Jeep. Objects. Guard lockers. Sure. In case I ever wanna, you know, get some guards. But more importantly, Ha 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 ha, weapon racks. Shit ton of weapon racks. Okay, that's good. That's five weapon racks. That should do it. And of course it needs a table to be a fully finished armory. I think this is this is fine. Um now the important question is 
Our prisoners are actually going to grab guns. They have free access to this. This I can tell you. Um, I guess I could set these to lock open. Oh, why are you opening this way? This is very confusing and I don't like it. You want this man? How about we just forego doors? It doesn't say anything about needing to be enclosed. So I'll just keep it open. I could have actually put the armory also in the hallway, I guess. Eh, it's fine. Here, big, big ass armory. Lockers just for looks. And uh, the danger level is high. That's always a good sign. That's when you know you need to add the armory for your prisoners. That, that'll that make them feel better. Okay. So the healing thing to heal the folks. What's that called? The infirmary. We shall have one of those. Ideally not too far away from the armory. How about we do that? We're going to need a morgue. Let's, let's be real here. For the most part, we're just going to need a morgue. Okay, let's get started by putting a door in. This is certainly interesting. Uh, deployment, right? I should have a, I should have a, a guards. I'm not going to at uh, attach metal detectors. Oh shit, guard patrols. Do I have to research guard patrols? I was not aware of that. Patrols. Shit, I didn't know that. You'd think they they'd be able to come up with that shit on their own, but apparently not. All right, let's uh. Guard checks in. Okay. Beat up that prisoner in a cell. Beautiful. That's what we like to see. Uh, I'm going to bring the guards up to 20. Cannon fodder, you know. The usual. Um, okay. Infirmary. I'm going to hire a bunch of doctors. Four shall do. I got a feeling we're going to need them. And now we're going to set up the infirmary. Right over here. Doesn't need to be... Massively huge. 5x5 five five is fine. Um, a bunch of medical beds. What we are going to need, though, is room for the Borg. And I, I follow the same principle as I did before. Just keep everything inside the same room. Motivates the uh, inmates. Oh, shit. That's infirmary. I need a morgue. Uh, motivates the inmates to not die. It's like, oh, see, see, this is what happens when you die. You you get put over there to the rotting corpses. God, it must smell awful in there. Um, also, these are like frigging, I mean, it's a slab, but it's also has like a sink and stuff. And I'm pretty sure you can do auto autopsies on that. So I just realized this is a missed opportunity. Ah, you can't, you can't really put those in between. You need to, I think, have the morgue slabs on a morgue and not the infirmary. Otherwise, that would have been great. Just like make it like inter uh, um, switch in between. That'd be fantastic. Might be possible. Okay, good. We have a few prisoners arriving. Um, Armory is open, free to access, but I'm going to make this a little bit more interesting. I have a plan. I have a plan. See that yard over there? I don't I don't think that's a good place for a yard. You know where is a good place for a yard? Right underneath the armory. Right there. That's the best place for an armory. I mean, so far nobody goes in there. Um, we don't have a cleaning cupboard yet. Uh, does a yard need to be enclosed, by the way? Secure. Behind at least one door. Okay, fine. We're gonna... <laughs> We're gonna put like some doors there and just keep them locked open just so this is acceptable. All right, yard time. This is where we're gonna put the yard. This yard goes away. No idea what we're gonna do with that yet. It's just an empty open area. Uh, I guess I'm gonna keep this locked shut because we don't really need access to that anymore. And there's the yard time. Beautiful. So it's important that they like, like he get to, got to enjoy it once. He just, you know, walked through there, walks for the armory. Beautiful. Oh, he just runs around. That's neat. And then he gets to uh, go and uh, grab a gun. I think. We'll see about that. So far, so good. We only have uh, medium security prisoners. Uh, fill up to 32. This is what we did. We have 32 people now in here. I think we can, for the most part, feed them. But I'm going to hire two more cooks to be on the safe side. Shit, this is filthy here. Uh, we're going to need a cleaning cupboard. Stat. Like, stats that, stats that, stats that. Um, below the kitchen, maybe? Maybe? Eh. Whatever. I'll 
put it over here somewhere. I'm trying to figure out where to put things. More complicated than I expected it to be. Uh, foundation, concrete, yeah, just over here. Just a small little cleaning cupboard. Hallway. There you go. I'm gonna actually make this one a little bit bigger. So we just have, uh, uh, so we can have more people to keep this clean because this is a filthy mess. What are you all doing in the holding cell? Oh shit, right, we don't have cells yet. Whoops. Whoopsie daisies. Well, shit happens. I'm just gonna add another prison block. That didn't go well. Oh shit, we have an escape, what happened? Oh, there's just friggin... <sighs> I was just adding this room and... Ah, uh, classic. Could we, could we stop this? Lockdown. Hey, just keep the doors closed so nobody can escape. Shit, they keep escaping. Could we please take care of that? Yeah, just beat that guy up. Okay. Would be really great if my workman could get to finishing this up before everyone escapes. We already had five escapes today. That's unacceptable. Need more workmen. So as you can see, I'm working here to extending uh, on extending that prison, which I hope will work out soon. If they eventually get to building that, is he resting? Oh, he's just in the hallway resting. That's fine. Sure. Well, so far I had some escapes, but no one really grabbing weapons. You know, you can also just put weapon racks wherever you want. So, uh, I know they're pricey, but why not just stack the hallway with it? Just see what happens. Uh, that was like $16,000 just in weapon racks, which I'm certain will just yield a return any moment now. Where are you bringing them? What the fuck are you doing? Where are you bringing them? Those cells are not done yet, you morons. You absolute colossal morons. They're just gonna escape. <sighs> They're the worst. Oh, well. Now, the question is if I do a shakedown. Oh, not that I have enough staff to actually pull this off properly. Are we even going to see people stealing guns? Is that even the thing? Or are they know like, oh, we're going to be in trouble if we steal. So, so far, no guns. So far, no guns. I think this only becomes relevant when you are, um... Having a riot or something, I want to say. Something along those lines. A screwdriver is so far the... Actually, a knife is the most dangerous thing. Um, I think intelligence is available if we research that, which I should do. Yeah, nobody's stealing anything. I mean, they have to pass the weapon racks to get to the canteen, so... Uh, what happened here? Unconscious... Oh. Open door. I can manually do that for you. There you go. There's a shotgun. I was wondering where they had it. Oh, shit. Oh, deaths. Okay. Okay. So, it's happening. Let's send in the guards. Let's send in the guards to stop this. Okay, we found two sniper rifles. Two rifles. That's good. All right. I like how slowly they approach the situation. All right. There's some dead people. Oh, yep, yeah, this this guy probably killed all of them. So it's a good good bet. Um, so far so good. Got a few guns out of this. Got them back. They're expensive. You don't want to just lose them. Got a feeling we gotta make the morgue bigger. Anyways, I think I'm gonna build this now. No route. How is how is there no route to build a friggin' door? Colossal morons. Anyway, bulldoze some walls. Demolish some walls. This all looks very promising over here. Um, I don't know what, what, something failed. I don't know, beds failed. Cause they, oh, right, you can't reach it. My bed! Ha, <laughs> my bed. Get it? Cause we're talking about beds. I'm awful, I know. So! Uh, time to put some large pipes down because this seems to be an issue. They will be digging their tunnels out of here, no question. And I don't want to deal with any problems. They're also going to be angry very soon because we're going to be running out of food! Classic problem these days. Classic problem. Uh, let's extend the kitchen. Let's extend the canteen while we're at it. Yeah, that looks good. Hopefully. Um, two more prisoners. And uh, see how they're doing. Oh, yeah, right. 
cleaning cup art. Totally forgot. It's a thing I wanted to do. Now that we have work, we actually don't really have work. <sighs> Logistics. Oh, prison labor. I'm certain that would help. Then we can assign that. Uh, they also need electricity, which they shall have. I shall provide them with the power of the gods at their fingertips. It's pretty crazy, you know, how we have electricity in our homes. I mean, isn't it crazy how I'm just making videos on the interwebs for you, for your entertainment, playing a game with tiny little creatures on a screen? Screens! Everything's crazy. Anyway, I have those moments sometimes. It's like this, like, wow. I fucking live in the future. I mean, <laughs> 50 years from now, people are gonna think like, dude, these Neanderthals. All right, another canteen, um, or extending the canteen room. And we're just gonna let things take their course as of right now. Just trying our best to just do daily business. I think, I think the question is, will this go, will this go okay? is the bigger question. I'm gonna go up to 48 because that's how many cells I have. I'm just letting maximum security in, which will take a while. That's to be expected. That's to be expected. All right, beautiful. Our canteen is coming along nicely and kitchen, very important to also take care of that. Electrical cable goes through all of this. Uh, we're gonna be extending with, uh, I guess, ovens and whatnot. Cookers, cookers, sure. Sure, call them, call them cookers. I call them ovens. See, 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 see who wins. Probably not me. Okay, there's the fridges. I'm gonna go by the amount 221 that we did before. So now we have six. That means I want three sinks to kind of like deal with the workload. That should do it. I think it's more important that uh, we have more guns available to us. I think we should just have them in front of every cell, or at least uh, in front of every cell for a hallway. I think I think two cells can share a weapon rack. That's not unreasonable. I think I think that's a very reasonable assumption. Um, I wish there was an easy way to switch out beds with double beds, because I just realized I could have so much more space if I just put double beds in here. But whatever. I think 48 prisoners will be good for now. Ah, screw it. Let's dismantle those cell beds and put double beds in here. Might be a little bit tighter, but hey, that's how you make friends. You share a prison cell with them. If that doesn't bond you together, I don't know what does. I mean, just be happy you get a bunk bed and don't have to share a regular bed. That is another thing. Cause you're just like, yeah, nope, that's for three people. You, you figure it out. I don't care if you have to cuddle. It's prison. This is in prison you get to cuddle man sharing a bunk bed in a prison cell with a toilet right next to bed That must suck. It's like one sleeping the other person is like worst diarrhea ever Okay, there's there's blood. Why is there blood? I don't care. Cool So I hope we have yeah, we have logistics now now we can set eight jobs for the cleaning cupboard, which I like and which means in our Regime we're gonna have to add actually free time and work here yeah, that's fine. And everyone gets yard time because that's important. In the yard, sure, some weight benches on both sides. Uh, how about just like two benches and because, you know, for obvious reasons. Weapon racks, two weapon racks. God, it must suck to work here. Oh, oh yeah, right, 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 right. Well, so far so good. The prisoners are enjoying their cell. Uh, you know what? I gotta open this. Lock open. Very important. Lock open. Um, so far, so good. I see no problems arising other than very angry prisoners. Uh, what's going on here? Failed bed. Oh shit! Right. Those are dormitories. How could I have forgotten? Those are not cells. Those are dormitories. Hey, uh, 64 people can fit in. Let's bring that up to 64, and we're gonna have 20. Jesus, we're gonna have 21 high security prisoners coming into our prison in the next episode. I hope you enjoyed this. Ah, oh, this is looking great. Uh, if you enjoyed this, please leave a like. I'm Weasel. I'm out, and I hope to see you around. Bye bye. <laughs>